looky here. Look who we have. Jesus himself. Hmm. What's he doing out here in the desert anyway? He's praying and fasting out in the desert. Oh, this should be easy. Hello there. Oh, it's you, devil. I couldn't help notice that you haven't eaten in a while. You know, you could eat if you wanted to. Why, if you have all kinds of heavenly power, you could easily turn out one of these stones into bread and nobody would ever know. Sure, I could do that. But I'm out here for a purpose. I'm praying and fasting to prepare myself for the difficult ministry I have ahead of me. This practice cleanses body and soul. Why would I distract myself with something like bread? People can't live on bread alone. People need nourishment for their souls as much as they need nourishment for their bodies. Oh, so it's nourishment for your soul you're looking for. I know how to satisfy that longing. Why don't you throw yourself off of this tall building? Well, the angels would catch you and wouldn't let you get hurt. I mean, that's what the prophecies say. I'm sure that would give your soul a boost. No, it would boost my ego, not my soul. What's the diff? One feeds the other and so on and so on. My soul doesn't need proof of the angels to be fed. My soul is fed when I spend time in prayer with God. Mm. Feeding my ego will only get me in trouble. I'm not long for this world, I'm afraid. <laughs> no, you're not, are you? Are you? <laughs> I've heard you only have a matter of a few short years left before... Adios, amigo! You know... This world has a lot to offer. It would be a shame to spend this little bit of time in it and not enjoy all it has to offer. You know, if you worship me, I will give you this entire world and everything in it. If you follow your current trajectory, well, you'll be dead soon with nothing to show for your efforts. But... If you follow me, you could rule this world forever. And lose my soul forever, too. Well, there's that. I fully intend to enjoy all that this world has to offer in the coming years, as I fully engage with the inhabitants of this planet. Living with and loving these people will bring more joy to me and to God than any material possessions you can offer. Hmm. So that's it. That's my final offer. Be gone with you. You have nothing to offer that God doesn't already own and have promised to everyone who follows him.